Welcome to this lecture. In this lecture, we are going to learn about three-tier store procedure architecture. In this lecture, we are going to learn about how we can divide our project into three parts. The number one part is GUI part, user insert data by using GUI or user can view data by using GUI graphical user interface like in our project GUI folder contains all the GUI forms and the second folder is about variables over BLL BLL stands for business logic layer convert data into information and store data temporarily it means that we are going to create all the variables in this folder or in this BLL section and the third one and the last one is DAL data access layer contains methods which communicate with the database so like methods are update insert delete select record from the database here is the SQL server and by using these methods, we can access data or update data or insert data or delete data by using these methods. So in this way, our working is very easy and very smoothly. So create a new folder and name is DAL and create another folder and assign name b l l and in this folder right click here add new atom simple select class because we are going to create a class that contains variables so variables are used to store data temporarily so like student b l l class and here we can create variables and press double tab quickly and here ID by using get and set property we can set ID value or get ID value so like that prop name string so name and same as string phone save it and go to server explorer here you can explore desktop km k5 m7 is your computer name go to tables go to students name id phone blood gender email ID name phone so string blood gender is also string email date of birth description prop email string dob prop 
string descriptions and created at is a default value created by is also uh, we can manage it and update it by we can also manage this attribute so id name blood id name phone blood gender email date of birth description so save it and also create a class in DAL section and add new atom and select class and assign name student DAL thank you for watching this video